groot rugby gaan saam met een lekker braai. Dis die echt Suid-Afrikaanse kombinatie, soos jy en Pick and Pay. As you can see, I'm still busy getting uh, ready and tying my apron here with the, the, the food wine guru, Michael Willey for you. Good morning. Good morning. Take us through our ingredients quickly. <clears throat> right. I see we've got lamb mince. We've got some lamb mince. We've got some pork mince there as well, just for a little bit of added flavor. Mm -hmm. And we're going to mix that with um, some Dijon mustard. My favorite. Absolutely. Um, some um, ground coriander. Did you have to quickly look what was, I was the label? I wasn't sure whether that was a coriander or that was a cumin. That's the cumin. There's I can't and they terrible teas. Garlic there <laughs> and <clears throat> some some cold fried onions. Then these ingredients here, the the olives and the feta and the mm. tomato and the rocket are for are for a little salad. Okay, so where do we start? Well we start with the <clears throat> with the and I'm, I'm not going to lie, and I'm going to say it is chilly out here. So I'm just warming That's my hands up. It's not chilly. On the it is seriously cold yes. out here. Was it your idea to braai today? No, it wasn't. But it is National Braai Week, so yes. So we, today is Heritage Day, and that's Braai Day. Yeah. So we have okay, to. Okay. So what are you doing right we have now? To do, I think what I'm doing right now is I'm just going to mix the um, ingredients for the um, for the burgers, mm. and we're going to add a tablespoon of of Dijon mustard. And Love if you want mustard. more, you can just add more. Absolutely. Mm. What just does the Dijon nervous. mustard do, though? It's well, it just obviously has got this wonderful flavour, mm. and it's soft. It's not hot like the, not hot like the English mustard, mm. and uh, it just got that lovely sort of mild burn to it. There we have the cumin, mm. and then we've got about a teaspoonful of. You're just measuring by, by hand. I know, but you know, I've done it for such a long time that I know <laughs> more or less how we're doing that. What am um, I helping with here? You can grind some pepper on if you like. Is this pepper? Yep, yes. that's pepper. And then we're going to add our garlic cloves. Our cold onion. And this is, yeah. Now, a lot of people will just simply add um, chopped onion, but mm. I just like to cook it for a little while because mm. it just it just adds to the, to the flavor. Mm. And then you mix it all together. And you mix it all together. And then <clears throat> what we'll do is we'll make we'll make a couple of patties yeah. here. And it's very but this is very healthy as well. Oh it is, mm. yeah. You know, you you don't have to put the you don't have to put the, the pork in, but I just like to, to have that that extra little mm. bit of fat and mm. flavour. Especially people who don't eat pork. Yeah, if you yeah. don't eat pork, well that's absolutely fine. My best you friend could, doesn't eat pork. So. You could put beef you could put beef in if you mm. like, happily. Right, do you need me to give you a hand there? I don't think you want to get your hands dirty, do no, you? No, but you know I can wash them. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. So there we've got two now. I will put them on <clears> the brine. If you, if, you, if you make them very flat, they're obviously going to be cooked through quite well. But if you have them that size, then they're going to be a little bit pink on the inside. Okay, pop them on so here. So we'll pop them on. <clears throat> and then just leave them a while, just so they get nice and brown. It's like how good I look. Uh, you look fantastic. I look like a, the bride queen. queen. I yeah. know. <laughs> I should be called Janina Bride after Jan Bride. Yeah. Right. Or maybe I'm just like Mrs. Sly or something. Now what we'll do is let's just pop. When do I turn them? Just now. You must give them a little while. Okay. We're going to toast our we'll, buns as well. We'll toast the buns. Let's just toast two of them. You just have are we to making watch cheese? We're not making cheeseburgers, are we? No. No. We've got some feta cheese for the for the. Um, that's and then, enough. of course, the magic word, if you're making this at home or you want the ingredients, 33728 with the word um, lamb. No, bry. I can't remember. <laughs> I don't know which it is. <laughs> no, it's lamb. L-A-L-A-M-B. Of course, Lethal can't spell this morning. So if you want the ingredients sent to your mobile phone, it's lamb, L-A-M-B. Can I turn yet? Um, no, just give me a while. Can I turn now? <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting really excited here. I love being around. I'm worried about the buns not burning. No, you just got to watch them. They, they will toast up quite nicely. Right, now while, while so you're doing that... So burger is actually our key word today. Burger Burger. Is key. burger. Uh, B -U -R -G -E -R, like B-U-R-G-E-R. Like skulk burger. As in skulk, there's no burger like a skulk, skulk burger. Skulk burger, exactly. Absolutely. That's so, the magic word today. It's Monday. I'm blonde. You've got to forgive me. I'm I was working an... at the Lurie's. It's understandable. I'm doing a little salad here <coughs> of rocket leaves, olive oil, mm -hmm. a bit of lemon juice. Do we only toast the one side of the buns? Um, oh, yes. I, I think they're getting burnt now. I'm worried about them. Well, then just take them off and okay. pop them back on the... 
So if you want the ingredients sent to your phone, burgers, B-U-R-G-E-R-S. And here I'm doing the salad, and we've got the rocket leaves, the olives, some nice cherry tomatoes, some yummy feta cheese, and we're going to oh, use... Oh, that looks gorgeous. We're going to use these to... Can I turn them over go, Yes, turn them. Okay, but you know now, a lot of people have this debate about cooking on a gas fry. It's not a real cooking. Yes, Jan Bry would not be very they proud of us. They wouldn't be proud, but you know what? In Cape Town, with the wind, you've got to be so careful if you're cooking with a, with a normal... Yeah, absolutely. Right, I think we need to get going now. We are going. Yeah, but I think let's, let's put these down and we can start putting our burgers together. Okay. These are still cooking. How long They're do we cook them cooking. for? They, they cook, no, that's I find I've got plenty okay. here. They cook for about sort of 10 minutes on each side for rare and then you take it like 12 for medium rare and if you want them well done, then you just take it. And the nice there. thing is you're making them yourself. So the magic word today, burger, B-U-R-G-E-R, to 33728, SMS right now, <laughs> and it will be sent to your mobile phone. Have you tried that? Yes, I have. We must actually try it live it's on air. It does work. It does I know. Work. It's okay. so wonderful if you're going shopping. So you cheated a bit earlier, yeah, and you made these. Oh, as you can see, I'm, I'm not a very handy. There we are. There's always a disaster Up when I'm around. There. And look, we've got a little wagtail come to visit us. Oh, there. that's cute. Wagtail being a bird. Work Do you want another one on that one? Yes, why not? Someone actually wrote on our Facebook wall to say to keep Liesl outside at the bri because she doesn't make any disasters like she does in the kitchen. Oh my goodness, yeah. that's not very kind. So I think this week's going to be my great week. <clears throat> so here we go. We've got some salad piled up on top. And we just put that on at an angle like that. That looks great. <coughs> and there Here's you have it. One. And we do that one. You hold that one. I'll start eating this you one. You start eating, will you? Is that fine? That could looks be fine. Good. <laughs> this looks really good. It's, it's big. Do I eat it with my hands? Michael? Yeah, uh, absolutely. I'm just going to eat the... I'll give, give you a cloth afterwards. <laughs> there we go. There's our pair of... A pair of lovely, lovely lamb burgers. Mm. And the one thing that you can do, I was in Uppington last week, mm. and they've got these amazing sweet wines, lovely muscadels. And you can dip your, your burgers in muscadel and pop it back on the grill, take it off and pop it in again. You get oh. this lovely, sweet, um, sort of grapey crust around the great. burgers. There we go. But I think you need a knife and fork with you all do, of this. Actually. Yeah. You but do, actually. I'm, I'm having loads of fun eating this. Excellent. Run us through the ingredients again. Well, we've got the, 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 the lamb and the pork mince, and we've added um, coriander, cumin, oregano, salt, pepper, Dijon mustard, um, garlic, and some cooked onion. Mm -hmm. And we've made four four patties, that's about 250 gram patties, so they are quite big, mm. um, which we've done on the on the braai. And then the salad is, is rocket, um, tomato, olive, and feta cheese with some olive oil and lemon juice. And for a family of four, what would this go for? For a family of four, it would go for sort of about a hundred-ish. Mm. Lamb's quite expensive at the moment. It is quite, but yeah. you know what? This is delicious. And can you substitute it with anything else? Yeah, sure. You could use you could use beef, all mm -hmm. beef. You could you could use um, chicken. You could use fish. So you can make lovely, anything. Yeah, lovely yeah. fish burgers. Well, Michael, it was always great cooking with you. Thank, Thank you, you so much. I've probably got burger all no, over my face. No, you are looking good. But it tastes delicious. Mm. Definitely something you can make for dinner this evening. And remember the magic word, 33728, with the word burger. Uh, singular, not plural, will get sent to your mobile phone right away. Also, the ingredients and the whole recipe will be on our website, expressoshow.com, right now. So go and take a look. You know what? I'm going to take a quick break and sneak somewhere else and eat this burger, burger. and not share it with <laughs> anyone. And we'll see you after this. Bye. Stay with Expresso and SABC3.